Facebook.com as Jake the Snake Roberts squares off against Dick Slater with Dark Journey in his corner with the North American heavyweight title on the line. Let's go to our ring introductions here. Did you hear that, Bruce? Dark Journey, notorious for having a, a little bit extra planted on her. You know, we're talking about foreign objects now, yeah, Alex. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I mean, uh, Dark Journey, very my, lovely. My apologies. Lady there, uh, but uh, has been known to be slipping uh, weapons and foreign objects to Dick Slater. So the referee, actually two referees, taking their time. Dark Journey with a neck brace, having uh, suffered an injury during a match. Referee Tommy Gilbert now That's searching it. Dick Slater. Jake the Snake Roberts very animated. Now here we go. Microphone is still in the ring from the introductions. And there's the bell. Now we're officially underway. Referee didn't even let both men get to a vertical base here. Snapmare takeover there by Jake Roberts. We are underway. Quick lateral press. Look at the leg. And a two count there. As kicking out there was Dick Slater. Wow, both men already to the outside. These two men do not like each other. Title is on the line. A lot at stake in this matchup. And two very great competitors, very experienced. Jake the Snake Roberts and Dick Slater. And Roberts pulling Slater back into the ring by the trunks. Right hand, left hand, and into the atomic drop. And down goes Slater. Dark journey on the outside of the ring concerned. As Jake Roberts has control of this matchup. A good shot of Dark Journey. See the concern on her face. I don't know if there was a thumb to the eye there or, or what, but Dick Slater just trying to get a little separation between him and Jake the Snake Roberts. Roberts now worked into the corner here, right hand from Slater. And tied along the line, and means the only way to win is by pinfall or submission. Over the top rope and onto the floor. The referee giving him a little bit of leeway here on that. Jake Roberts uh, breaking the fall um, on the outside area of the ring. Now Dick Slater with a boot to the head. Another hard boot to the forehead. That's Jake Roberts in trouble. Again, both of these men to the outside of the ring. Dick Slater now with a chair. Now Dick Slater chair. using that steel chair very effectively, driving it into the forehead of Jake the Snake Roberts. Roberts on the outside here, favoring that forehead. Again, notice the lack of any padding on the floor, ladies and gentlemen. That is the cold, hard concrete floor. This is professional wrestling, ladies and gentlemen. This is not sports entertainment. And Dick Slater in the ring, dark journey now. Referee sending her back to her own quarters. Jake Roberts trying to fight his way back into the ring. And a boot right to the head of Roberts keeps him from slithering back into the ring. Dark Journey, very, very unpopular. Um, they had to have extra security brought in whenever she was uh, at ringside. Wrestling fans strongly against her. Now it appears as if Jake Roberts may be lacerated. Shoulder now driven into that ring post. Jake Roberts, you can, you can see the laceration there just above the eyebrow. Of Jake Roberts. Yeah, it looked as if that steel chair shot lacerated uh, the forehead of Jake Roberts. 
the blood now flowing freely down the face. Fans here in attendance chanting out DDT, DDT, of course the signature maneuver of Jake the Snake Roberts. Dick Slater now, some very effective hard right hands. Dick Slater, well known throughout wrestling for having a very hard punch. Dick Slater now working on the neck here of Jake Roberts and choking him while tied up in the ropes and the referee just trying to break the two up here. Jake Roberts now tied up on the outside of the ring. Dark journey there with some psychological uh, warfare of her own now. Slater with an elbow, driving that elbow into the cover here. One and one count as Jake Roberts is able to kick out here. Dick Slater now taking his time. Jake the Snake in trouble on the canvas. The crowd chanting DDT, DDT. Dick Slater now working on the face of Jake Roberts with that left hand now comes back with a right and down goes Jake Roberts into the cover here one two and a kick out from Jake the snake just a brutal matchup so far here between Dick Slater and Jake the snake Roberts again the North American heavyweight championship is on the line oh it's a very unorthodox maneuver, almost a figure four type uh, leg lock. Head scissors actually into a modified reverse head scissors. Dick Slater now working on the neck of Jake the Snake Roberts. But the way he applied that maneuver, Bruce, from behind, kind of snapping the neck back. And look at that. It doesn't look like there's any motion in that left arm of Jake Roberts. Oh, there it is. Dick Slater, of course, having a lot of international experience, has wrestled extensively in Japan. Well decorated, uh, both of these men in their pro wrestling career. You notice how Slater has his body position. He's got Jake Roberts on his side, so that head is at a bent downwards. Roberts now trying to change the positioning, trying to trying to escape from that head scissors, moving back now. Trying to bridge out of it, and all, he has Dick Slater in a cover there. They actually got a one count. Slater reapplying the pressure on that neck and the side of the head of Jake Roberts. Fans chanting out, go Jake, go. Fighting out of it there is Jake Roberts. It's back to a vertical base, back elbow, and down he goes again. Nice escape by Jake Roberts momentarily, but then Slater scored with that back elbow. It would have been who of Jake Roberts to kind of retreat to the corner and just trying to regain his composure, but went right back on the offensive, but found himself out of position and took the back elbow from Slater. And again, Slater taking it to the outside of the ring. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Jake Roberts in a very precarious position there, ladies and gentlemen. Dirty Dick Slater. Working on that wound on the forehead of Jake Roberts. You can see the blood coming down. He has to have lost a lot of blood by this point. He was lacerated fairly early in the matchup, Bruce. Headbutt. Diving headbutt. By Dick Slater. Jake Roberts all but out. Just dragging him back to the center of the ring. Tugging on the head. Elbow drop right to the sternum. Into the cover. One, two, and a kick out by Jake Roberts. Jake Roberts on instinct alone, ladies and gentlemen. Roberts crawling to the corner. 
using the aid of the turnbuckles to get back to a vertical base. Head off of the turnbuckle, blocked at this time. Dirty Dick Slater takes his head, bounces off of the turnbuckle. Little tit for tat, as once again, Dick Slater has his arm rammed into that turnbuckle. Now those, that wrist tape goes into the fist, and now this time, Jake Roberts choking at Dick Slater, referee trying to get in there and break that up. Jake Roberts using that wrist tape, wrapping it around the throat of Dick Slater, doing anything he can. And this is the opening Jake Roberts needs. It's that DDT, it only takes a half second to apply. And once he does, the match is over. A knee lift right to the face of Dick Slater. And he is teetering on the outside. Now Jake Roberts goes after him into the guardrail on the outside. Just phenomenal action here. Take a look at the fans, ladies and gentlemen, on ringside as they are enjoying this action. Jake Roberts now with a steel chair. Well, Slater used it earlier on Roberts that opened that wound that you see right there on the forehead of Jake Roberts. And now the snake using it against Dick Slater. Oh, ramming his head into the lower abdomen. That might have been a little lower, lower abdomen, if head, you know what I mean, Bruce. Head butt into the solar plexus. Has Jake the Snake Roberts in serious trouble. Dick Slater, of course, very well known for having a very hard cranium. As he's used that headbutt now going for a... Going for the figure four, and he has it applied here. Submission maneuver. Jake Roberts feeling the pain. Pressure being applied on that left knee area. Those legs tangled up, excruciating pain. Looked like a spinning toe hold initially now into a figure four leg lock. Jake Roberts now reaching for the bottom rope. And he's got the rope. Referee telling Dick Slater to break the hold here and he finally takes the legs off of Jake's. Now Slater dragging Roberts to the outside. He's limping, oh, a reversal and Slater's face goes face first into that steel ring post. Unbelievable matchup, ladies and gentlemen, between two amazing competitors now. Both back into the ring, ladies and gentlemen. Roberts sends Slater off and an elbow to the back of the head of Jake Roberts and down he goes again. Just when you think Jake Roberts is back in control of this matchup, Dick Slater, he's as good as they come, Bruce at getting back into the matchup when it looks like the chips are down. Dick Slater now on his knees, crawling over. Couldn't we see that figure four one more time? No, looks like he's got it rolled up. Leverage from the top rope, and Jake Roberts is pointing up at the top. The referee now seeing that Dick Slater's got a hold of the ropes. And now Roberts pushes Slater off. Lack of awareness from our in-ring official here. It's Jake Roberts going to those left hands. Now with a right uppercut. Slater, woozy, looking like he's about to go down. He's spaghetti-legged at this point. Roberts says, oh, one more. It's blocked, and Slater retaliates with a right hand of his own. Who's going to deliver the last haymaker here? Roberts with a big one with the momentum off of the ropes. And down goes Slater into the cover. One, two, and a kick out. A kick out by Slater. I thought that was it. Phenomenal action. The North American Heavyweight Championship is on the line. Both men go down. What a collision center of the ring. Ringside fans are on the edge of their seats, ladies and gentlemen. Alex Del Barrio now on the ringside, on the edge of our seats, as well as Dark Journey now. Jeez. Pulling Jake Roberts to the outside, and Dark Journey on the apron, having some words with referee Carl Fergie. And, and now Dark Journey being pulled, pulled down off of the apron. No, now she's in the ring. Jake Roberts has a hold of her. Jake Roberts now. Oh, and Dick Slater, you gotta worry about your opponent, Jake. Uh-oh. Slater has him up.
going for the pile driver. Oh! oh. In perfect position now, Slater driving with the distraction, but the referee still attending the dark journey. He says her neck, she needs to be attended to. And now Jake Roberts kicks out. How did Jake Roberts kick out of that pile driver? Now Jake Roberts tied up in those ropes by Dick Slater. The referee now trying to attend a dark journey. Oh, Dick Slater. Referee now dispatched by Dick Slater to the outside of the ring. And you can hear the boos from the crowd here. Oh, DDT! DDT! Jake's, Jake Roberts caught him with the DDT! The cover! There it is! And the second referee, Tommy Gilbert, makes the count. It was that quick, ADB. With the DDT, Jake the Snake Roberts scored the win. Jake Roberts has that North American Championship draped around him. And we told you that DDT can just come out of nowhere and that's exactly what happened there. The referee was sent to the outside by Slater. Jake Roberts found that little bit of real estate to apply the DDT and that was it. What an amazing matchup wrestling fans. You can only see it here on NWAclassics.com. Jake Roberts, your winner for the North American Heavyweight Championship.